This is a handy tripod I picked up at Goodwill. Right here, three dollars and eighty-eight cents. Yeah, and it's still got the plastic covers on the legs here. I'll show you a few features here. The rubber foot pads on here, you can screw them, and little spikes come out to help grip. Oh, well, I guess if you're on a slick surface. Those sharp little spikes will bite in and your tripod won't slide around. But I'm going to unscrew those. I like them out. In case I want to take it in the house, I don't want it scratching the floor or anything. But yeah, this is a Vectra V-E-C-T-R-A, Vectra SV410. That's the trade name on it. And for $3.88, I don't care what the name of it is, right? Can't go wrong there. Here, the only thing I noticed from wear and tear would be this Phillips screw here. The head is a little bit worn. And that's where you tighten up the handle here that tips up and this is where your camera mounts. And that's nice and snug. I mean, I like that setting right there. So I'm just gonna leave it alone. Now the other thing the tripod has is these legs that have two extensions. So she'll go pretty tall. I'm going to say with that height, you can see that's touching the ground right there. So that's a good, you know, probably four feet. And then this crank here will raise it up another 10 inches. Okay. Now this crank you can put into a storage position there. I'm not going to open it up and set it all up, but I just wanted to show you some of these features. There's a lock for everything, every motion it makes. So this lock here is for the cranking, this crank, I'll loosen it so I can crank it up, but tighten that. Now I can't crank it, okay? This here, if I loosen this, now I can rotate camera and then I can tighten it up here and there's no rotation. So a couple little locks there. I'll loosen this, crank her on down, bring that in and there we go. It's all ready to take with you. Pretty good find there, goodwill. So remember, do something nice for someone today. Love ya!